love the idea of finding a Jew, whether it's in the streets of Manhattan or out in the boondocks in Montana, and getting an opportunity to do a mitzvah with them and to share with them the beauty and joy that exists in the heart and soul of Judaism. Montana, you never have to lock those, but if you have a mezuzah and a gun, you're, you're guaranteed to be safe and secure. The people who are members of my congregation, I'm their rabbi. I'm the one who would be called on rather than he just shows up at their house uninvited. Non-Orthodox congregations respect each other's membership and do not poach from each other. Chabad doesn't have these kinds of boundaries. Put it together to your heart and give it a shake. Did you do it yet? Okay, here we go. We got a double mitzvah. You never know what you meet on Main Street. Go back to Israel where all the kike bastards live. <laughs> The message throughout the attacks was, we will destroy you without even touching you. There is hatred and bigotry rearing its head in every town around our country. I have laid roots in this community and I want them to feel safe and comfortable. That's what it's supposed to be like living here in America. Just for fun, we'll do it in Yiddish to see how your Yiddish is. Afrelech in Hanukkah! Afrelech in Hanukkah! Look, look, you finally got it. We're doing good. I have a little dreidel. I made it out of clay. And when it's dry and ready, 